Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Rennick Estates. Behind me, this beautiful little wall that we, or palisades that we finished up last weekend. Tuesday, actually. So, we only have a little bit left to do. And, uh, here it is. I'll show you guys quickly. Right, so we have one, two, three. Hey, morning, wife. Morning. <laughs> Four and five. So, today we have two things to do only. So, we have no excuse to finish it. We need to finish a little wall. You can see there, I only got four more layers of bricks. We're going to be digging out the bricks here on the floor so we can recycle. And then we're going to put up one, two, three, four palisades. The fifth one we're going to leave open. Why? Well, we kind of need to get that side to paint and everything. Hopefully we yes. can start that we tomorrow. We can start that tomorrow, yes. All right, awesome. Guys, thank you for joining us. Remember, it's your first time. Click top left. Video 10 is where this whole thing started. So, yeah, let's have some fun, woman. Yes, let's do this. Give me a kiss. Okay. Mwah. Mm. Let's do this. So we said last week we were going to show exactly how we do it. It's not really that difficult, but I mean, if you've never done it before, one or two pointers would actually help out. So the long story short is we need to fit the palisade between the poles, two corner posts. So we, like we said in the first video, we planted the poles. We ignored the width of the palisade. I mean, the corner post, which is 76 millimeters. So we need to cut it down by about 35 also millimeters on each side going down. Right, a little bit more, but you get what I'm saying. So to do that, when you measure, we measure it across. So imagine this palisade is overlapping. You measure it across, make a line, do the bottom, make a mark, and you just flip it over and then you pull your line. All right, so that is how you do the measurements. So we've measured that side already this side here and um, I know you get fancy pencils and markers and what 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 the easiest thing for me and I'm sure you can see in the camera is a pink pencil yes. simple as that don't go buy the fancy hardware what 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 it doesn't stick to everything this is simple pink crayon it works the best so go to your child's child's what's it pencil box yes. oh, that's a word go to the pencil box steal the pink and just accuse them of losing it. It's as simple as that. <laughs> All right. And then, yeah. So I'm going to cut this off. This one's a bit difficult. What we had to do here, let me show. To drop it down, I took the distance from the bottom to the top, which is 27 centimeters. Divided up by two to get half the distance and cut each one halfway down. Because if you look here, we have this little lift here and we need to bring it as down as far as possible. We're going to have an issue that side already because the um, palisade is too high. So we got some beautiful volcanic rocks here in the garden that the previous owners brought in. Thank you to them. And uh, we're going to use some of them to actually fill the bottom. Otherwise the bad guy is just going to crawl on and anything get in anyway. We don't want that. No, we don't want that. So it's difficult because you want to balance. You don't want your palisade to be 
on the ground because it's going to get wet, it's going to stay wet for longer and rust is well, going to happen from the bottom of, up and you also don't want it too high because then they come in. So what you want is a nice balance for water to run off and uh, no one to be able to climb in underneath. That's what we're looking for. So for now, let's cut this off, let's get it welded and let's do a shop. Yes. You get paint. We need paint. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. So we did the cutting, the right side is like a millimeter way more than enough for us to weld it. See it's snug at the bottom, left side is snug, um, top left is snug, and then it is perfectly level, it's exactly what we want. So yeah, so why is the top right hand side not so snug? I cut skew. Yeah. Okay, guys, so one of the things that we obviously knew before we even did that is that we're going to have to, someone's going to climb over here quite easily. Oops. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to weld rods here in between. That is going to, well, make it a little bit more difficult to climb over. And then the next thing is, you might see that it's a little bit, it, it looks loose. And it looks flimsy. And it is. That's actually one of the things that's unique about the Palisade. It's not a solid, so when you climb over, it's like walking on a tightrope. And that is the danger about it, behind it. So it's not so much the, the um, spikes, the spikes are going to help, but um, it's the tightrope effect that we have. So this is quite strong. I can climb on here easy. It's not going to break. And I don't want to pull it too hard because it's not get my chin in here. That would be awesome. No. <laughs> that would be terrible. Yes. So that's the whole idea behind it. We don't want this to be rock hard and bulletproof. Otherwise, you're just going to climb over it much easier. So that's why we went with it. Because of the tightrope effect and then the scary look. Yes. Ah! <laughs>
I remember that why I don't like bowling. <laughs> it's just hot in the sun. You no, know, and so, the bricks and the dirt and the. But it looked awesome. I think you did an amazing job. For someone that can't bowl. Yeah, for someone we, we can't bowl. You're doing a great job. Well, so, guys, uh, thank you for joining us again. So, yes. as you know, like, subscribe, and then yeah. Next week you've got to paint. Oh, that's even worse. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So next week, literally, I'm gonna make the thumbnail. What's it? Watching paint dry. Yeah, watching paint dry. Although I'll be doing most of the labor work. Yeah, I didn't like painting. I know, but someone has to do it. I'd rather go donate a kidney something. Ew, keep our kidneys. <laughs> Alright, guys, okay. have a good evening. Okay. See you next week. Bye. Cheers, bye bye.